Hello everyone, welcome to the Imprint Explained and today we're looking at Operation Twist again. And this is a topic from Indian economy. And we're looking at what is Operation Twist and why is it needed. Uh, before uh, you understand what is Operation Twist, I think uh, you should have an idea that what are government, what is the government security markets. So try to understand the fact that the government doesn't have money on its own, right? It is actually borrowing from the RBI. Uh, so what it does is that it actually issues some bonds, which are known as government securities, and these are of different uh, time frames. So there'll be a 364-day treasury bill, there'll be a 182-day treasury bill, there'll be a 90-day treasury bill, there'll be a couple of years, right, let's say a five-year bond, a three-year bond, or a 10-year bond. Now what happens is the government basically says that we, I will pay you an interest rate after so many years. Now, this bond, because of its being backed by the government, is traded on the secondary market as well. So even though, obviously, the bond might say 6.45, it might be traded at a different percentage, like, for example, at uh, 6.06 and so on. Uh, because it's being traded in the market, what happens is that it sometimes has a variation. So the short-term bond vis-a-vis uh, -vis the long-term bond can be uh, different in the type of interest they might carry. And this is a huge problem for the government because when they want to go in the market to raise money again, uh, this can lead to a, some, sometimes a problem. And for that, uh, we, when you know, the government wants to soften the 10-year yield, we do something known as Operation Twist. So what happened? So the RBI has announced uh, the simultaneous purchase and sale of government bonds in a bid to soften the long-term yields. And what they do are doing is that they are buying uh, 10,000 crore of bonds maturing between 2026 and 30 and selling the same amount of treasury bill. And uh, this was first used in December last year. This is something that you should know. And uh, what exactly happened? Uh, the response was the yield on the 10-year bond dropped by 20 basis point. Uh, the, what would be the impact? Uh, as I've said, uh, that the government might get cheaper sources of funds, especially in the times of Corona hit, right? We require, uh, we might issue Corona bonds. We would actually raise money for uh, reboosting the economy again. So for that, we definitely need to do this. Uh, also, the other reason is the repo rate is at an all-time low in some ways. We are at 4.4%. So we want the repo rate to be uh, the policy rate. So if that's the case, we cannot have a government security trading at 6%, 6.5%. Therefore, this operation test was done even in December and even uh Right now, it's going to be down on 27th. So just to revise, what is Operation Twist? It's the selling of short-term securities to investors and buying long-term securities from investors. These investors can be scheduled commercial banks and other people who are, you know, holders of government securities. Uh, also can be NBFCs and other financial institutions. Right. Uh, as, uh, this is the article from the December 23rd, uh, where uh, Medhavi Aroda, she's an economist at Edelweiss, she says this is extremely good. She says the action of Operation Twist by the RBI today is encouraging, uh, that is then. And this is needed to bring down uh, the term premium that is, remains a driving factor for long-term economic activity and addition of new investment stock. At that time, it was not seen as you know, as important that is, is, it, is, it is now, I would say. Uh, remember, Operation Twist was undertaken uh, by the U.S. Federal Reserve in 2011-12 uh, right, to make long-term bond uh, borrowing cheaper. Right. So OMOs are done, right? So open market operations where government securities are sold by the RBM. This is normally done on Tuesdays, I think, in case you don't know, right? Uh, uh, the basic idea is to, as you, as we talked about, basically making loans less expensive to buy homes, cars, and finance investment projects. That is the basic idea, right? Now, uh, just to, if you want to have a detailed look, uh, what actually happened? So in the first operation twist, what actually happened was the government actually bought more securities they bought long-term bonds, bonds worth 10,000 crore, right, twice, but they sold less, um, you know, in comparison, right? Uh, they show, uh, sold less short-term bonds, uh, that is with uh, bonds with low residual maturity, right, than in the past. So this is, I would say, interesting because I, it, then it points out the fact the government wants to actually focus on the physical side of things, the interest borrowing, the interest payments that they're going to do later on. Uh, 
right? Uh, but, uh, you know, whether it will be effective or not, that is debatable this time at least, right? Because the uh, LTRO, the long-term uh, repo operations has not uh, yielded what we wanted to, right? Because everybody is expecting the government to do this. So, but, but in the first round of operation twist, the yield of the central government long-term security fell in the market, and this was a success. Right, uh, short-term bonds uh, were sold uh, at that time of 9th April, 3rd May, 9 June, and so on. So, uh, at the end of the day, I think uh, this puts a lot of liquidity in the market as well. So that is also a good step, I would say. Uh, thank you so much for listening. Do like and subscribe. Join the Telegram group for a PDF of this video. Do comment.